Hey, what's going on guys? It's Justin here and I wanted to talk a little bit about this coronavirus and all that good stuff. Um, so the first thing, don't let it worry you because over 40,000 people in the US alone die every year of the flu season and I think over like a million die of heart disease. This is insane. Uh, this is just a regular flu guys and um, what you can do to really protect yourself, even if it does truly become truly global, I think there's only been like 132 deaths and 6,000 infected right now, but keep your immune system optimal. So don't eat fast foods, don't go out and, and go all over the place right now this time too, if, especially if you ex suspect that it's like further than what they're saying or whatever, it's just a regular flu though. So when you're healthy, you're optimal, um, and you're taking care of yourself, you can fight this flu off, no big deal. Like, it's really nothing. Um, they make it seem like it's like this crazy virus, um, but it is related to the SARS virus. And it's just a, it's part of a corona family strain. It's just a regular mammal virus, but it's, you know, it's got a little like, adaptation to it so it can like really create a lot of complications within your cells and stuff like that so it's pretty crazy but again it's just like it's just like a flu and if you're healthy you'll fight it off and it only really hits the elderly so uh but yeah this is like a fear-mongering kind of thing they really pump it into the media to spread mass fear and miss like like there's no information around it and everyone seems like you know, they're like quarantining everybody. They make it seem like so extreme, which, you know, when it's good to have that protocol, but it sends the wrong message to the to the world, right? And uh, the main thing is don't worry about it. And if you really want to play it stay safe for the next while, like till this blows over like a month, you know, pick up lots of food in bulk and, uh, <laughs> and you know, hang out and, and like, you know, try to, if you can take time off what, everything you're doing in life and stay out of those uh, crazy situations. But... I don't see it getting to that crazy level, but you know, who knows, right? Like, uh, these viruses can do interesting things. So, um, but yeah, that best way to take care of yourself is just don't allow your immune system to drop down. Take your vitamins and minerals, you know, take your fish oils, like don't eat fast food, don't eat garbage food, eat organic food and take care of yourself so that your immune system is optimal. You could, you could do anything. You could fly right down in China and you'd be fine most probably. But uh, but the main thing is, you know, if you're around people, like if you're going to China or something like that, it's just like block, you know, don't, don't breathe in their air and stand near people that are like sneezing and coughing and sick. And I think that the, the most like thing that, the thing that you get the worst is like if you fly, that's like usually when I get sick or whatever, if I'll just go on a plane or whatever. And if I'm like, a little bit like stressed out my immune system's low and i didn't get much sleep or whatever i'll go on those plane rides and there's like and i'll get like a flu so it's no different right like you know and the symptoms are basically the same as an ordinary ordinary, ordinary flu it's just like you know headache fever sore throat stuff like that it's just typical symptoms so um but anyway uh, I just wanted to make this quick video on the coronavirus. The main message here is don't freak out. Don't let it bother you. Continue living your life. And, uh, and don't be racist because everybody in every country creates all kinds of problems. There's nothing wrong with, you know, China and stuff like that. So anyway, it's kind of interesting what that brings up with people too. But yeah, don't be worried. Stay safe with your friends, your family loved ones and let this blow over try to stay off the news and this in the media because that can really send the wrong message i find because it's really nothing like there's, there's no like it's just like an ordinary flu it's like oh let's send some fear in 2020 you know what i mean it's like they could really like just the way they talk if they talk in a way that's not going to send that fear then it would you know it would calm people down but fortunately ain't doing that so here i am making videos about it because it's like really no worries guys no worries world it's like they make it seem so they blow it out of proportion global right you see it so anyway thanks for watching have a beautiful day and they awaken the aesthetic version of yourself and inspire others
Cheers. <laughs>